You cannot pass tails. That's something that this game brings that uh, Mario doesn't. Um, you can play as multiple people. I like it. I like that, and I like what they do with the story with the other people. It's kind of funny, in my opinion. But regardless of that, let's continue on. So emblems are basically the stars of this game if you're comparing it to Mario 64. You will be collecting emblems throughout the game, um, and I thought you went over there, you obviously do not. But in the other hands, I think that new stand over there will often tell you. Um, a lot of games I like to talk to everybody, um, and normally I would, even on a regular playthrough. But, it seems like a tedious thing that um, I shouldn't do. And Chow Garden, that guy just mentioned the Chow Garden. If you wanted to go in it, it's not in that elevator, but in this elevator, that is something I will be showing off. But not yet. What the heck? Oh! Pay attention to the cutscenes, sir. So we gotta the take. Headed for the Mystic Ruins will be departing soon. We gotta go to Mystic Ruins, Hub World, Sonic Adventure has them. And then the camera stays where Sonic was. Mystic Ruins Adventure Field. So collect emblems. There are a lot of emblems in the game. Um, you get them by just generally completing levels and by doing certain tasks. So I'm just going to run around here for no reason. Oh, and I'm also going to be showing some... I'm going to show a lot of the bonus stuff. I'm going to be showing a lot that this game has to offer. Because this game is really fun. It has a lot to show. Um, I'm just kind of running around as I explain things. But this game does have a lot to offer. It's a lot of fun. There's a lot of little bonus things in it that you would like to do, that you might like to do, that I like to do. But not for the sake of this let's play. But anyway, let's cutscene. <laughs> if it isn't Sonic! Look, it's a giant talking egg. <laughs> I, I am Dr. Robotnik, the greatest scientific genius in the world. Whatever you say, Eggman! Enough! I've got big plans! And now, I'm gonna put them to work! You're always up to no good. Now what do you want? I want all of the Chaos Emeralds! Never not interfere! Or else! Or else what, you big loser? Or else I'll take them from you by force! The hard way! Something I want to mention that I haven't mentioned yet. Well, first, actually. Egg. On it. So welcome to the second boss of the game. So this is the acorn. Uh, like I wanted to say, the, one of the thing, one of my favorite things of every single Sonic game in the universe, um, mainly the. 3D ones. I never, I didn't grow up on the old ones, so there's. I don't have the nostalgic desire, appreciation for that music. But the music in all of the games, that, all the Sonic games that I have played, is just freaking amazing. It's one of my favorite things in the entire freaking Sonic existence. Like I, I, I like to listen to this music just, just in general on my iPod and stuff like that. It was just so awesome. Like, a lot of video games, they have good music, but none of them compare to Sonic music. That's just my opinion. None of them. Sonic is just so awesome with, with music. Whoever decides the music lyrics, uh, art, music, everything in the music itself, I don't know how to, what words to use on that. It's just a freaking genius and should get a raise every single time he comes up with a good song. Loading's longer than I thought. Hmm. 
Well, that wasn't so hard. What the? Don't ah, hold it right there. Oh no! Put it in your invisible pocket. Come on, chaos! Time to eat. Chaos. Oh no, isn't that the same monster I saw the other day? Oh yes! It's just the stone tablets predicted! <laughs> super buffed up on. His strength increases every time I feed him a Chaos Emerald! With all seven emeralds in him, he'll be invincible! And work for me! Together, we'll destroy Station Square! And on its ruins, I'll build Robotnik Land! The ultimate city, where I will rule it all! Come on, Chaos! Let's find another Emerald, shall we? We can't really get away with this, can we? No way, Tails! Without more emeralds, the monster can't transform! So, it's up to us to get the emeralds before Eggman does, huh? So, Chaos is a cool enemy. I like Chaos. And I keep pressing X to change the camera for some reason. So, this is a GameCube game. It's a remake from a... What's it called? Dreamcast. The Dreamcast game. The Dreamcast game had not as good graphics as this game. This game uh, is basically all the same graphics except for the character models. They have been updated. Um, this game was actually released after the remake of the second in the series. Uh, for some reason, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle came out. And then suddenly, uh, this game came out because it was such a huge success. At least I think that's how it happened and why it happened. That could be wrong. But, uh, okay, there we go. So I got, thought I got stuck there. But anyway, this is the opening to the next level in the game that we will be doing. So let's go. So the hub world isn't that bad, but it's kind of... I prefer not a hub world, personally. But... That's fine. That doesn't bother me. And then that happened. I forgot that that happens. That literally happens to me like every time I do that. I remember doing that in the past, actually. But I'm gonna try one more time. I don't know why I'm going to try one more time. Oh, but it's gone forever. And you'll never see it again in your life. Unless you play this game. So, ignoring that ball of light, run! Just pull forward and then you'll run through the wind. And that is a trampoline, as you know, obviously. So, first game in the 3D series. Oops, 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 oops. That bridge normally falls. Whoa. And tornado! Um, I don't know what to say. I feel like. I'm supposed to be explaining something, but I'm not explaining it, so I'm kind of stumbling over my words as I talk, because I'm like, wait, I don't know if I'm saying this or something. Jump on panel number yes, you explained one. this to me before, Miss Light, Miss Light, Miss Voice in my head. It's a voice within the voice in your head. That's interesting. Don't you think? I think. Sometimes. Yes, that's one voice in your head as a thought process of its own. Amazing music. Every, like... 99.9% .9 of all tracks in 3D Sonic games are amazing. I just love it. It's just so amazing, and I might actually get lost within the music because it was so awesome. I'm trying to appreciate it. And while he's running so fast, it looks like he's walking. Like his animation is like walking, basically. 
So, rocket! And if you're ever spin dashing and you want to start running for whatever reason, just press B and Sonic will turn him back into his running position. I, I find the running version of Sonic, where he's not in the ball, is easier to control. So that's how I do things. What the? Don't do that to me, sir. Break now. No, I didn't. Just it. I normally go up there, so I'm finding more paths that I don't normally go on. So I'm running on wind. I never ran on that wind before. I'm just, just discovering new things with this playthrough, and I've, I've, I've literally beaten this game, oh, uh, like, I've beaten this game a lot. <laughs> I don't know how many times, it was, it's not as much as I might assume, as I might be implying, but I've beaten this game quite a bit. Uh, my favorite Sonic game, I, I already said this, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle is my favorite Sonic game of all time, one of my favorite games ever. Like, period. Like, but, yeah. So, the Chaos Emerald is here. Yes! I'm trying to think of some things to say, but I'm just drawing a blank. I haven't, I haven't recorded anything in a while, guys. I've been so busy with life. Yeah, not bad! That's uh, just... I have to keep doing this, but I like doing it. It's fun. I'm gonna keep doing it. I'm gonna keep trying to do it, and I'm gonna have fun while, while the train I do it. Headed for Station Square will be departing soon. So that might be a hint to where we should go next. We can go there if we so desire, and I think that is what we desire. Yeah. I even like this song. I don't even know. What's going on with this song? Oh, that's cool. Oops. Yeah, that, that happened when he did that. Okay. I gotta stop singing and provide actual commentary. Sir. Anyway, so let's go back to Station Square for the next thing to happen. I think. <laughs> I haven't played this game in so long. Oh, I didn't know where we were supposed to go. Now it's this way. I originally thought we were supposed to go this way a different time. But now we're going through it now. There's a hole, a manhole. Because Sonic's a martyr. I used to think that was a nickname for <laughs> nickname for a different word for a guy. Anyway, so anyway, these are Now you've got light speed shoes. Light Press speed and hold shoes. the action button to store up power. Once you have enough power, release the button and you can do the light speed dash. The light speed dash lets you race toward rings at light speed. As long as there's a trail of rings, you can go just about anywhere. Thank you, Miss Voice in my head. I will be referring to that person. Use the light oh. dash to run I along the paths else. of rings. Hold the action button and let go when you have enough power. Ready? So future games make this 12 times less tedious by just letting you press B and then you go. And you're done. And now we're breaking into a store. Hey, help me use the back door. Ah, stop doing that. Okay, so got the light speed shoes. Spin dash and 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 spin dash. And you can do that. It also lets you zoom forward even if there is no trail of things. So that's something interesting that when they fix that, um, they take away. So fixing things comes at a price. Anyway, we want to come in here because once you get the light speed dash, you have the ability to get another ability. Or not another ability, but another upgrade. Ready, go! I used to have trouble with that when I first played this game.
This is the crystal ring. This reduces the time needed to store power for the light speed dash. Whoa! Now, the time is like reduced quite a bit, so now you can do it at that speed. Shao Garden, I already explained how to move it. I'll be doing it more of it later. I'm not sure exactly if it's going to be at the end of the game or sooner. But anyway, there's a convenient little button here to create a path of rings. And what do you do when you have a path of rings when you just get an upgrade for it? You press, you dash through them, and then press the button to open it. So this is a little, like, it's, it, it's required, but it's a little bonus level. 